Oz. They made it sound like I was supposed to be sneaky for this mission. I don't know how sneaky I can really be. And this one is actually in the factory itself. Is there like a path that I wasn't able to go on before? There has to be like scary monsters in the way, right? I was there before. Honestly, fast traveling there seems quicker. I'm, I'm gonna... Make an executive decision to fast travel here and walk down. Because I shouldn't have to really fight anything on my way over there. So it should be easier, I would think. The only thing would be the, um... Oh, I'm still stuck as Evan. They actually... Yeah. I was gonna say they made me, like, the... Basic, uh... Characters, but I think it was just because they got rid of Brock and because that's who I was playing as at the time. I thought they were forcing me to play as... The, like, three titular main characters. Since Brocken and Batu and the likes aren't really shown. Like, they don't have that fancy art for them. And then I just have to go down this way. Easy peasy. I mean, oh. I'm raring to go. Who are you? Blitzer, you're just some guy? Scary. I mean, we can deal with you pretty easily. You're only level 46 compared to what we have, so... Not too worried. I just didn't expect to see you stand there. Ball. Damn it. Mm, I didn't think you would turn towards me like that. Oh, you know what I forgot? When I was fighting Bastion, I... Oh, it's that glow doing down there. Well, we got the processor, so I'm glad I went this way. We can help Andrew now. Um, when I was fighting Bastion, I changed one of Roland's attacks because he gets one that can boost his, like, attack stat for a little bit. And it costs only one pip of magic, so you can kind of do like the two swipes in a boost. Mm. The door is locked. We'll have to find another way. Why is it locked? <laughs> don't be ridiculous, man. Let's just give it a bit of a shove. Enter. Come on now. One, two, three. We have spring lock, don't we? Uh. No, stop. We'll trip the forced entry sensor. Oh. Off the heck, what are all these robots saying? Aids of. They detected a breach, so the security levels have been ramped up, which means we're going to have to stand and fight. I don't feel great about this, actually. This. That's a bit of a large group of enemies. I would have probably been better off. Probably would have been better off not starting this quest right now. I think we can handle it. Not now. I'm gonna have to, like, restart. Unless if there was a checkpoint. But, uh, we should be able to handle it. I just need to heal up from the fight to get the processor. Unless if that saved for us, that would be nice. But I, don't, I doubt it. I still think that it was a good idea that I went from to top down, so I didn't have to deal with any other fights. So yeah, we're back here. Switch party back up. How about equipment? How's my equipment doing? I think it's fine. Pretty sure I didn't get anything too important. Let's uh, still be rolling. And also, I don't think I have anything I can do tactic-wise. Ooh, I got more battle points, though. So now I can raise evasion a bit. 
and then two more and I'll be able to get that done. And then I, I guess just keep going with some of this stuff. Being able to do more damage to like multiple enemy types would be nice because they're not always just slimes. It's just a shame that it doesn't really help me here though. But like getting Andrew seems fine if that's all he needed. Although I can see him maybe wanting more. Because that seemed too easy. And then I'm just going to head back up to the save point. Heal and then try to get the... Other... Thing done. Here goes. I just think like what would help is being able to go a little nuts with my skills. Before like for that big group of enemies. Come on, Higgledy friend. Here goes. Damn it, ball. Oh, and then I got balled out of there. I'm a little scared for Roland's life at the moment. I keep forgetting that you can, like, do that win thing. Alright, we're good. And we got the thing. Yes! Good stuff. Back to the save point. The testing facility. I don't know why my icons are gone now for side quests. Not the biggest deal, I suppose. Hopefully that's all he wants. But I, I mean, when you see the way he looks on the uh, recruitment thing, Andrew like has a kind of goldish shine. So we probably need to like go back somewhere else to get him a new like paint or something, paint job. But I'm hoping that the processor is just so powerful that it changes the color of his shell. That's what we'll call it, robot shell. So I should probably... Yeah, I think I'll just go all out with my magic. I was thinking about maybe waiting until I got the percentage on my weapons up to 100. But I think we'll be fine. I'm glad the wyverns aren't standing here. Hopefully this will open the door. Why don't we just use spring lock? Decent damage, but also took a lot of damage there. Here goes. Leave me low. If I can deal with you guys, that would help a bit. Ball. Ah, oh, damn it. I was really trying to dodge out of the way. Ball. I got level up, so I'm good. And we only have one more left. See, I told you it was fine. It seemed like it would have been doable. But I just wasn't really in the right spot for an actual battle like this. We did it. Yes. That should do it. The door's unlocked. Let's head into the research lab. I collected everything, okay. I got more dark crystals. This one? That one. Beep boop. Take a little while for the system to reboot. They're all done. Okay, the system's back online and we're good to go. The door to the room where Oz's was trapped should be open now. Yes. Was there something else we had to do here? This one is look for delivery robot. That's like out in the world though, right? Defeat Skrek in a mine. I think he was like in a cave. 
We got your thing and another cave. All right, so right now we're good. Back to the entrance. It's Andrew's down there and the uh, guy's down there. Well, at the very least, get Oz. Andrew, I can see giving us some problems though. Andrew's a bit of a spicy boy. Hello. Oh. Finally, I'm free. I thought I was going to be trapped in there forever with just security cameras for company. Don't worry, you would starve eventually. You must be very relieved. Wait a sec. Was it you who saved me? I was the one you were talking to to said I would Thank save you. Much. Wow, thanks. That was probably the nicest thing anyone has ever done for me. I really owe you one. I wish there was something I could do to say thanks, but I don't really have much to offer. Hey. Why don't you come and be a security guard in my kingdom? Wow, really? You'd let me do that? I'd love to work for a bunch of nice guys like you. Actually, that was one of the things that I was thinking while I was locked in, that, in there. This is perfect. Nice. And we got a shot of salad? If it's security you need, look no further than me. My boy. Boop beep boop. I can't wait to slot in that quintillion core processor and give myself an upgrade. Yes. Beep, beep, yay, beep, yay, you got me my quintillion core processor. Time to put myself back on the cutting edge. Boop, boop, beep. Well, Kraken Metals, are you going to do the honors? Uh-huh. Sure, here's hoping this will make you a little less dang manipulative. Get ready, Andy. I'm going in. En voila. Voila. Beep, wahoo, I feel like a million guilders. Oh, he, that does just change him up. I don't like the color that much, but I'm so glad we get a robot. Beep, boop, hey there, Evan Petty Whisker Tildrum. Boop, beep, hi there, Bracken Meadows. Beep, boop, boop, beep, I'm amazing, incredible, more powerful than ever, thank you. Oh. Sounds like somebody's feeling better, you got our names right. <laughs> of course he's feeling better, Evan Petty Winkle Tildrum. He's had the full Bracken Meadows treatment, <laughs> Boop, beep, beep, boop. Actually, I've been thinking it was super nice of you to agree to get me my new processor like that. I was thinking I might like to live in your kingdom where people are all that nice. Mm. Really? Oh, wonderful. I always wanted a robot. You'll be more than welcome, Andrew. Boop, beep, thanks. I'll be sure to shout next time I'm due for an upgrade. Oh, man, we've created a monster. Nice. I'm so happy. When we brought Andrew from brought Andrew from Broadleaf, he was malfunctioning pretty badly. Well, we got him fixed up, but to be honest, I missed the way he used to be. Now he just keeps pestering us to give him more work. Heh. <laughs> There's such a thing as being too efficient. Efficiency is never a bad thing. I tis better to be useful than not say I. Well, either way, folks seem to love him. I love him. He's beautiful. What do I need to do now? First, let's do this junk and then actually get the blimp. So we can at least fly to other caves and whatnot. I do want to recruit more people, but we should be good, right? Yes. I actually right. do need to go back to Hydropolis, though, to get that other girl. Alright, so we have... The honor of doing this. Level up that kingdom! We should be able to put more buildings in too, I suppose. How is this gonna look? Better be sick. I can definitely upgrade a lot of stuff, which is gonna be nuts. So, you know, once I'm done recording, shit's gonna get wild. Pretty good. Pretty good. It's like just taller, but it's still nice. I need 64 facilities built and 100 citizens. That's basically all of them to upgrade it again. And then just do this the best that I can. All right, that's my limit. So now we can hold a lot, which is great, finally. I know I can upgrade a lot of places too. 
and build more full-fledged farms, ranch, massive market garden, expert explorers guild. Oh, that's good. I don't have the money for it, but that's good. Officer's training ground. Ooh, boy. Ooh, boy. I'm gonna get a little nuts here. More hunting lodge, hunting lodge. Elite barracks so I can upgrade my stuff. I'm glad that there's more versions of those to upgrade, actually. Higher innovation is gonna be great. I need to actually do that first. Huh. I'm not gonna be able to get the money right away for this, but... I'm excited. What is it? 50-something? Yeah, that's the first one I'm gonna have to do. Was this open space? This wasn't here before, so we did expand this. More fishing. And another lumber yard. Multi-dimensional lab. We can upgrade that more, even though I haven't really done that. Hyper Hubble Bubbly. Battle rewards. Okay. Yeah, a lot of good stuff. A lot of excitement. I'm I'm gonna just go nuts with this shit. Alright, that seems to be everything though. That's good. Right, this was the limit of... No. Yeah, this was. This was the limit before. And now it's not. Bountiful Bazaar and a finer fishing. So now when we upgrade to level 4, I, I really don't think there would be anything else. Evermore is expanding, and the castle at its heart grows ever grander. It is much more lively than when I first came, and I look forward to more wonderful facilities being built one day. This will be the greatest kingdom in the whole world, wide world. Glad to see you so proud of the place, Lily. Li Who's Gerald? I am proud. I will do all I can for Evermore. I don't remember Gerald. Should I know who that is? If I can upgrade a bunch of buildings, too. So, like... I'm probably gonna just go about grinding that stuff and some levels so I can do side quests. Because a lot of my side quests are a bit higher level than what I think I am at the moment. Alright, so can we just like mash this down? Finally upgrade this. Alrighty. Time to make some modifications. Come on, Bracken, not to face anything but that. What's the big idea? It's dead weight, Zip. Sorry. It's gonna look sick though, right? Now we just need to get rid of this. Try replacing it with, let's see now. Aha! Uh -huh. Then a little adjustment here and here, and... Woo, yeah! Voila, perfect. Even if I do say so myself, uh... can read that. My beautiful Zeppelin, it looks sick now! Shut up, Zip. I like it. I love it. Well, too late to worry about it now, I guess. She's all yours. Yeah! We can fly now. Find a wide open space on the ground anywhere on the field map, and you should be able to call the Zeppelin to come and pick you up by pressing triangle. Not only will it allow you to whiz around the world at greater speeds than ever before, it will also be able to access certain spots that have been unreachable until now. While flying around, simply press X to initiate the landing sequence. You can then pick an obstacle free spot on the ground and press X to land. Oh, Evan, I, uh, I need a little favor. Mm. Of course, President Vector, what is it? Well, uh, it's like this, see? I will, uh, now that I gave you the Zeppelin, I kind of don't have a ride home. Would you mind taking me back to Broadleaf? Call it a test flight. Any place around there is fine, just as long as I don't have to walk the whole way. Thanks, pal. I wonder if... I mean, we wouldn't have been able to get to Kingdom Level 3, so I wouldn't have been able to upgrade the shipyard. I wonder if those upgrades for that are going to affect this now. Oh, that's how landing works. That's kind of the same as it was in Nino Kuni 1, wasn't it? Turbo boost! Here I go, flying all the way. I like this airship, it's nice. So we haven't really gone to this tundra spot yet. There's like a big submarine. I saw this on the mini-map. This kind of freaked me out. There's a large submarine. I would like to know the story behind it.
Can I land here? That's perfectly fine. Yeah, it's the same thing as the dragon in the Inokuni one. Good test flight. Thanks. Thanks, guys. How about that Zeppelin, huh? She flies like a dream. Look after her now, you hear? Now what? Red Omihati's home, where'd we go? Wait, Zip arrived right when Leander was just about to tell us something, didn't he? Alright. Oh, what was it you want to say, Leander? Yes. I'm a spy. Let's return home first, we will talk more there. Hmm. Hmm. I was was Leander the one that was in the hood? Cause I saw like Leander's blonde hair, but it kind of didn't look quite the same. Oh God, more stuff. I don't know who these people are. Can you believe Zip is letting us have his airship? He's so kind. Of course, we had to get rid of the super ugly face on the front. It looks a whole lot better before you know. Zip, I hate to break it to you, it really didn't. I she is not wrong there, and pal. I think Crikey got rid of that ugly mug. I'm afraid you are solely mistaken, Zip. It looks much better now. I love everyone has to chime in. Okay, okay, enough already. I get it, I get it. That's the thing, fish, that we have to fight for that one mission. Feast your eyes on this fearsome beast. It wasn't easy getting this shot, I tell ya. I was convinced me luck had run out and I was destined to end up as the monster's breakfast. If you're gonna snap a fang fish, you need to see it mighty gob but all its glory. Look at its mouth. I have never seen the likes. I don't know how you did it. This is the most awesome thing ever. You really risked your life for this one. Thank you so much for your wonderful work. This is simply extraordinary. You went all the way to the desert? Gosh. Finally, I have met my true love. Now we shall be together for all eternity. Oh, this is bliss. Well, I'm glad she's happy. Uh, so obviously we need to just go back home. I do need to go to Hydropolis real quick to recruit that one child. And then I am assuming that Higgledy mission is going to have me go to the Queen's Chamber. I don't know where else there would be a princess mermaid. Hello. Join my group. Hey! Oh, it is you. That means you must have it. You do, do you not? Come now, do not play the fool. You would not talk to me if you did not have it. They gave you it at Swift Solutions, yes? The permit to make Daphne a subject of a very special kingdom indeed? Is that how it works? Show it to me, please, and quickly. There is no time to waste. Alright, well, like, I got you for the fish market. Woo! Perfect. Permit accepted. it. I will not let you down, and do not be fooled by my appearance, I am in fact a most talented fisher person. And we fisher people have duty to venture to far off foreign lands. Galacus is always talking of the romance of the distant ocean. Not that I wish to copy Galacus, of course, I am my own fisher person. If anything, he wishes to copy me. He's already at my kingdom though. I heard him expressing an interest in joining your kingdom too. Mm, no, of course I was not eavesdropping, I just happened to overhear him, that is all. Anyway, enough talking, I must make my preparations, and if you see Glaucus, um, tell him hello for me, teehee. Uh, okay. That was a lot of information there for no real reason. I need to find the Higgledy. Which one's the Higgledy mission? That one. It looks like it's this way. Wait. There's more side quests here. Oh no, I forgot I need to go look for other side quests in other places. Is this world ruined? This is actually not where I need to go for that Higgledy mission. Can I see the main menu, actually? The main map? Oh, maybe I do. I don't know. I guess it's... Do I have the Higgledy? I didn't talk to the girl again, did I? I don't think I have the Higgledy. Good day to you. <laughs> Greetings to you, honored customer, and welcome to Halamid's hair salon. What color shall I dye your hair today? Purple! Oh. Dye my hair? Oh, no thanks. I'm quite fond of it as it is. Hmm. You're not here to dye your hair, then wait, I recognize you. You're the young king who made the public proposal, are you not? How romantic. Haha, <laughs> look at that, Evan Munn, you're the talk of the town. Hang on a minute, though. She's a hairdresser, isn't it? I knew the people in Evermore who's been hankering after a fancy new one. Evermore, oh, you wish for me to move there, yes? I'm flattered, of course, but I'm far too busy to leave my salon at the moment. And besides, I have no interest in working with people who have no appreciation of beauty. Wow! 
What the flip? Cheeky so and so, I'll have you know we love a little bit of beauty over here our way. Very well, then you will have no trouble in proving it by bringing me the hue blooms I require. I probably have the ones you need. To flip and right, we won't. Come on, Evan, let's show our friend over here. We've got the proper eye for color. Well, Lofty, I'm not even sure what the... Oh, all right, then. And you're right, we could do with a hairdresser over and evermore. <laughs> it would appear that we have an agreement. Excellent. Please bring me a hue who bloom with a cool blue color reminiscent of the ocean surrounding Hydropolis. Yes. Oh, I didn't want to make it active. It doesn't hey. matter. Oh, I have to consider it. Oh, wonderful. Cool and blue and perfectly reminiscent of the ocean surrounding Hydropolis. Uh. This is exactly the hue bloom I had in mind. You did well to find it. <laughs> well, we... That's right, man. The pot was a piece of cake, man. Told you we had the proper good eye for color. I don't have a good eye for color. <laughs> Excellent, I will stand you good stead for my next request. What? What? More for bananas? Hmm. Any Philstein could pick the correct two bloom once. It proves nothing, and I simply must know that my future king has the appreciation of beauty I require. Gah, fair enough, I suppose. Better safe than sorry and all that. Very well, the next two bloom I would like you to bring me is one that shines like the midday sun. If your appreciation of beauty is as well owned as you claim, you should have no problem finding it. Is this good enough? Dazzling star? Soil? It's like just brown? Ruby? Just a color fire. I don't know. We'll try this. Oh, <laughs> uh, yes. This is exactly what I had in mind. I assumed. Who in this shines like the midday sun? How astute of you to see that the only the citrine would fit the bill. Perhaps you really do have the aesthetic sensibility and appreciation of beauty I seek, but one final oh. request. Really, does that mean... Perhaps, but I have yet to be fully convinced. Fetch me one more hoop bloom, and I will uh, no doubt shall be assaged. Flippin you got to be flipping. Oh. It's not too much to ask, is it? After all, I find that gathering hoop blooms is one of the greatest pleasures for athletes such as ourselves. Now, the final flower I would like for you to fetch is a variety that I have yet to see with my own eyes. It is said to be elegant, imperial, and ladylike. What does that mean? We've never actually seen it. Sally, no, or should I say, not yet. Your sensibilities are as finely tuned as you claim, and I expect you will have no trouble in discerning which one it is. I don't know what you mean. Smoky quartz? Coral, maybe? No. I feel like you guys probably have coral, though. No. The red one? I don't know. I'm just going to try them all. It's not like it matters. Flip. Flip. Emerald. Flip. I can probably get it from my gathering spots once I upgrade them. Or you do the like new ones. Flip. Nothing else over here. So, I don't know. I guess I'll head backwards. Not backwards, but towards the... Uh, that Higgledy quest again to see if maybe I do somehow already have the Higgledy required. I doubt it. I probably should have gone to the kingdom real quick just to check. Oh well, too late for that. Let's go collect these people too. Look at these children. What are they doing here? These sky pirate children. Oh! Oh, hello, what are you doing in Hydropolis? Where are your parents? <laughs> Our big runner. We came here with our father, but we liked playing here so much we decided to stay behind. Tis a veritable paradise. <laughs> Yahar, I that it is. Are Excuse we gonna play tag? Oh dear, everyone must be worried sick about you. Children shouldn't be wandering around in faraway kingdoms all by themselves, you know. No, uh, why don't I take you back to the Sky Pirate space? Huh? Not on your life, matey, your child yourself, curse ya. You. And here you are going hither and thither with Neria grown up to watch over your. How come I'll. Now come along and play, will ya? Yeah, all right, come along and play. I'm sorry, but I didn't come here to play, and I really don't have time, if, so if you... Hey! What's that now? Sorry, can't hear you. If you want us to listen to you, it'll have to beat me in a race. I'm good at races. Yeah, all right, race! All right. Fine, I'll race you if I must, but if I win, you're coming with me to the Sky Pirate Base, all right? Deal! Hee-hee! <laughs> Just let us know when you're ready to start the race. Mm. Yeah, all right, we're ready to go whenever. Okay. Uh, I guess we'll race. 
Are you ready to start the race? Yes. He, you're all set, right? I'll explain how this works, as simple as simple can be. Whoever makes it to the finish line first is the winner, and there's no path that you have to follow, neither. You can run wherever you like. What's that now? Where's the finish line? Why, it's just over yonder. Right there, where the kid is. Now, are you ready? On your mark, get set, go! I have a general idea of where to go. Hopefully, this is faster. How do I get into there? Go over here, climb up, and then just drop down, right? Can't drop down like that. Am I winning? That kid didn't stand a chance. <laughs> I can't believe you beat me. Curse there. There's something special and no mistake. <sighs> Who? I... I didn't expect you to be so quick. I, you must have had a lot of practice. <gasps> You're faster than him. You're much faster than stupid old King Evan. He just found some cheater's shortcut. That's all. That's allowed, though. <sighs> I know that, you mangy swab, but that's all part of the game. Gar, and there I was thinking I knew I'd drop this like the back of my hand. Turns out I have still got a lot to learn. But come on, you, I lost first square, home time. Roy! Aye, aye. Hey! Wait, let me take you, it's not safe. Haha, -ha, much obliged, your majesty, but what kind of sky pirates would we be if we couldn't even find our way back home without help behind? You heard what he said, ta-ta, your majesty. Well, that was fun. That was a fun, goofy mission. I do have to head all the way back around, though. Would it be better if I just fast traveled? Fast travel back to Ankara Harbor. And then I'm still gonna go over by the... The Queen, just to make sure no one has anything interesting to say there. <laughs> 